Hello everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can add and remove icons and applications from the bottom toolbar on your Mac OS X computer. So to add an application to this toolbar down here, usually we're going to add applications that we use on a regular basis so we have easy access. To do that we actually need to find the application on our computer. So we're going to start by clicking on the little finder icon at the bottom left of our screen and then we're going to navigate to our applications folder. From here, we can add any of these applications simply by clicking and dragging them down to our toolbar. So let's say I wanted to add the dictionary app to my toolbar. I could click and drag dictionary down. You'll notice that when I get it in the toolbar, the other apps start to move apart to give me a place to set down dictionary. So I can choose anywhere in my toolbar to place the dictionary and then just drop it and it will always be located there for easy access later on. Now at the same time, if I wanted to remove an app from my toolbar, so let's say we now want to remove the dictionary app, I can do that in a couple of different ways. One way would be to right click on the app, go to options, and choose remove from dock. That would take it off my toolbar. The other way is to actually click and drag it up a little bit until you see a symbol of kind of a trash, smoky symbol there. And when you drop it, it will disappear from your toolbar. It actually used to be automatic when you dragged an application off. You wouldn't have to wait for that little trash symbol to show up. But I think people were dragging applications off their toolbar by mistake. So you now actually have to wait just about a second there until that trash symbol shows up. Notice that on the right side of your toolbar, uh, you cannot put applications. So if I try and drag dictionary to the right side of my toolbar, it won't let me put it there. That part of your toolbar is just for folders. So I could take this GarageBand folder and I can drop that over there. Um, so be aware that folders go over here to the right, applications to the left and go ahead and organize your entire toolbar so that it fits your workflow. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you want to see more technology tips and tutorials, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.